All right, you guys, we got something special for you tonight. Um, shout out to the subscriber who requested this one, man. We got Muddy War Waters. Muddy Waters got my mojo working live in 1966, all right? So let's get it. See how it just, it start out riding out. You know what I mean? I like this. This feels like I'm like the tempo of it kind of feels like a little Richard song, really. But but the way he's delivering the vocal, like it, it the way he's talking, it almost feels like a blues. So like it's kind of weird, you know what I'm saying? Um how one on one side you getting fast tempo music, almost like swing music. But then his vocals sound like blues, like it's kind of cool. Got my mojo working, but just don't worry on you. I want to love you so bad till I don't know what to do. I'm going down and lose down to get me a mojo head. I'm going down and lose down to get me a mojo head. I like how the guys are singing with him, man. I like that. Mojo working. Got my mojo working. Got my mojo. Yeah. I love this. <laughs> I love this. I, I love looking back. I really do. Like, uh, it just see, it just feels so genuine and real. You know what I'm saying? This is like right on the end of the sixties, you know what I'm saying? And you get, this is, this kind of music was actually probably outdated by this time. You know what I'm saying? Cause we're in the psychedelic era, you know what I'm saying? Janis Joplin, Jimi Hendrix, you know what I'm saying? Joe, Joe Cocker, like, you know, 
we in that generation. So, yeah, yeah, because this that this this feels like swing music a little bit too. A uh, little rock and roll, little old school rock and roll as well. Man, I really wish this kind of music would survive. It should have survived, man. It really did. Like, I just, I don't like it. I don't like it. These men work their whole life to master their craft, man. And the only reason they probably stopped making money is because the music industry stopped promoting it. Oh, it's not what people want to hear. You know, it's not what the mainstream media or mainstream folk want to hear. You know what I mean? And you get these little buzzwords and stuff. And, uh, now you just sitting here like, what do we do? How do we, how do we stay on? You know? So it's curious to me, like, you know, how did they, you know, keep the band going? How did they keep money flowing in? Is this is all they know how to do? You know, man, this sucks. <laughs> Word on me. Oh, I messed up the word. Just don't work on you. And a lot of these type of songs was actually your TV sitcom intros or outros, too. I miss that time. And I never even lived in that time. Like, I just feel like that music should have came. It, I know music evolves over time, but I think some, some, some of this stuff should have stayed in, man. I really do. But, man, uh, shout out to the subscriber who requested this one, man. Post your comments down below. What do you guys think about Muddy? You know what I'm saying? He said, got my mojo working. All right? I catch you guys later, man. Uh, if you guys want to donate to the channel, um, be sure, you know, if you want to use Buy Me A Coffee, all donations start at 15. Um, if you want to expedite it for the next day, 25. And sometimes even the 15s can kind of work themselves depending on what I got for the day. But, uh, yeah, with that being said, I catch you guys in another one, man. Peace.